Hey, what is everybody? This is your boy, No One Shall, come at you with yet another Star Trek week in my video. Today, we're going to actually build the Enterprise, uh, Enterprise A, I believe. Let's go take a look, because I earned it over time, and I might as well build it since I can. So, we'll go to the Explorers, and not that Enterprise, this Enterprise. This Enterprise I'm going to build, and how I earned it over time, this is an overtime thing, because you know I'm G5, Ops 56, yada, yada, yada. I earned it through the... We go to our alliance tab, boom, 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 and we go to G4 epics. No, G4 epics. No, it's under G. Yeah, G4, not G5. So G5 epics. That's partially the way I did it, and the other way I did it was, of course, through factions. Over time, getting more faction credits for Federation, which gave me the point of unlocking the blueprints for the ship. But before getting the video, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell notification down below. Remember, don't forget there are donation links listed down below if you do want to help. But don't forget to leave a comment what you think about the video, how you feel about it. Is Enterprise A your favorite, D, whatever it is, because I'll have an Enterprise D video coming up. Congratulations, um, Morbid John and Archimedes. They just both got the Enterprise D. That is a level 60 ship. This is a level 50 ship. So let's go down to the point of looking at the ship. So let's go to Explore and build but before we build the ship we're gonna have to do a read up on it the uss enterprise a stands for both a fond tribute to its fallen predecessor and its hopeful look into the future commissioned by starfleet and constructed in the yorktown station in 2263 the ship was completed Soon after the destruction of the previous Enterprise, which fell to the hands of Krall and his swarm. The Enterprise A follows the same basic configuration, the predecessor, but it, predecessor, but was given more than a notable upgrade with uh, trials of the past behind them. The wonders, uh, wonders of tomorrow ahead of the meaningful or magnificent vessel will carry the crew into the uh, far unknown to boldly go to nowhere no one has gone before normal stuff that's about the normal so it's going to cost 3150 g4 or common and 9000 g4 gas common so some of the information on it for me i probably have some upgraded warp distances but two letter warp right off the bat remember i do have the commander that does it the fleet commander Carlos 286 or 282 which ain't bad um and then all my upgrades yada 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 so let's hit the build button on it Let's build it. I ain't going to instant build it because that instant build is 300K in Latinum and I'm not down for it. So let's get the build 11.7K for me and bam, ship's coming out. We can see this beautiful girl coming out of the birth of your star base, which makes me extremely happy to see this ship coming out. I know I'm already a G5 player, but I'm a ship collector and I'm always going to want enterprises because I have the basic enterprise, this enterprise, and I want that prize D. Then we have our so much in this game of enterprises because, well, Star Trek is mainly enterprise where most of the ships come out of. But here we go. Here's the enterprise A. Let's go ahead and tour around the ship. Bam. It looks really magnificent from what we see. We're going to hit done and we're going to uh, swip the ship quick. Put Picard on it, might as well. You see it out of the dock without anything on us. 54k. We take a look at it out of the station. Boom. There is Enterprise A. Let's grab the Enterprise, other Enterprise. So let's go Explorers. Grab that Enterprise, which is going to be basically the same thing because of the skin. Not really, but boom. There's the next one. I don't think I have any other enterprises in the game, do I? Let me double check. Explorer. And I don't think I have any other enterprises. So there are my two enterprises in space. And I do have a skin for it, I believe. Over time, we were able to get the skin for Enterprise D. So we'll bring it back into the dock. And to manage, let's swap the skin out. Up and top that refits. I believe I enterprise D skin. Yes, I do. Bam, enterprise D skin, which is damaged. So now it is in the rifle place of enterprises. As you see me pulling out of the dock. Bam. Here's enterprise D skin next to enterprise A. And 
we have a card on it, which is kind of cool. So let's bring the ship back in the dock and go take a look at some upgrades since at least it's a resource spend day. So let's go to upgrades. So we're looking at commons for there. Commons for here. Um, more commons. Then we're still looking at more comments for that. I think the first tier is going to be mostly comments, I believe. Yep, with a few G4 things in it. Boom. That is the first tier. Once we go through the first tier, we're going to tier it up again. And we're going to go take a look at its next set. So, as you see right here, we're still in the commons, but we're in the common resource for ship parts, which gets pricey after a while. Boom. And let's see what is slowing me down here. See, that's where I have to stop because it requires rares or uncommons, which I don't have. I got to scrap more ships for it. And let's take some experience into it. And we didn't look at its ship ability. Its ship ability is as long as Enterprise A has morale, everything it hits increases weapon damage by 1%, or every time it gets hit, it achieves weapon damage by 1%, which is cool as long as it has morale, which that means it's going to be gaining it over time as it gets hit, which makes it nicer. So let's see what it is when I get it to, well, level 10. As far as I can get it right now, as you see, 64K. And right here, 2%. Over time, so as long as that U.S. Enterprise has morale every time it gets hit, it increases weapon damage by two percent. So that is over time. So if you gets hit what ten times in a battle, it's a twenty percent increase. And the longer you go in the battle, well, the more it comes out. As you see right here, we're gonna pull it out of the dock again. Show its power currently. Bam, pull that out, and its power sixty four million out of the dock, which just isn't too bad, which makes it well worth it. Um. I just wanted to build the ship just to show you guys the ship. And that's about it, guys. Don't forget to hit a like, hit that subscribe, hit that bell notification down below. Don't forget to leave a comment. Um, if you guys do want to help support the channel, there is a uh, PayPal donation links. We have Zelle, we have Cash App, we have Venmo. If you guys do want to donate, it would be greatly appreciated. Um, I do stream every so often, so don't forget to follow my Twitch. And I'm trying to do more videos for you guys to bring more content for you guys to be able to well bring more to you guys for you guys. All right, guys, it is your boy Noah Shao signing out. Peace out. Have a wonderful day.